Hey everyone, welcome back to A Slice of Gaming. I am the only Python 4, and this is Mary and Luigi Partners in Time for the Nintendo DS, and this game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. And what the fuck is that thing? Um... Weird. Oh no, don't, don't think about it, children. No, the drink. Anything but the drink. Alright, we've got ourselves the very first boss fight of the game. Okay, don't attract, attack the uh, swiggler, as it's called, directly. Because you're not going to be doing much damage to it. So... As you can see, there's two Dr. Shroobs on the left and on the right side of its body. Those are going to be key for this battle, and you'll see why in a second. But let me just attack the Swiggler and prove my point. See? Not much damage. And after it, you do that, it's going to counterattack with that Shockwave, which you will have to jump over it three times. And this thing's angry! Why so angry? It's going to shoot up poison dust clouds as well, too. And I better heal myself. So, here's the key to winning this fight. First, I'm going to use an item. Heal up myself. For everybody. Mmm, delicious. Now, attack one of the shrooms with the gray mushroom. Notice how the mushroom went into the drink. It's going to have a drink. And now it's weakened. This is a perfect opportunity to attack. Just ignore the shrooms in the meantime. If a red mushroom gets in the drink, it will heal the shroob. So just keep that in mind. So if you happen to let that get into the drink, then you're going to have some issues. So now's a good time to use one of my brother's items, the cannonballer, which I will be doing. How this works is, as you can see, they all jump into the cannon. Remember the order they come out. So we've got Mario, Baby Luigi, Luigi, Baby Mario. That didn't go too well. But we got a 40 attack. That's pretty good. Let's try this again, shall we? On the swiggler! Okay, so... Luigi! Baby! This! Get that! Yeah, you have to press the buttons in that particular order that they come out in. So basically, if you can figure out, this caterpillar thing is drinking the vim, giving the vim to the saucers, which fuel their power. Yeah, bizarre, I know. But that's how it works. It's a method that seems to be proven good, I guess. If you kill the Dr. Shroops, they'll just reappear, so don't waste too much time on them. Ooh, there we go. Grey Mushroom. It's what we want. Put it in his drink. Poison his drink. I'm the, I don't even care. Let's see. We'll just heal Mario in this turn. That's right. Take a drink. Tasty, huh? Very tasty. We can also keep poisoning his drink as well, too, just to keep avoiding that saucer attack that we had a while ago. So let's do as such. Drink! In there! I mean, I wouldn't drink that weird color thing, would you? Okay, let's see if we can get this a little bit more correctly this time. There we go! That's what's supposed to happen. Oh no, he's mad! But guess what? Your drink's poison, baby. Not much you can do about it. So this boss fight's going to take a while. As long as you've got the strategy down, Pat, you should be fine. Aw, uh, no gray mushrooms this time. But let's be careful. Let's not put that in his drink. But instead, let's use another brother's items. Let's just use all the cannonballers we got. It seems to be doing lots of damage right now. This one's easy.
Another one, please, and thank you. There we go. And he's done. Lots of coins and experience. Guaranteed to level up. Oh yeah. Let's raise... Let's do stash. Because I'm guaranteed to get lots of stash points. More mustache power. Oh yeah. Gotta get that shine. And strangely enough, they can get shine too, even though they don't have mustaches yet. That was a pretty good level up, I think. And there's what we've been looking for. You got the second Cobalt Star Shard. You've collected two Cobalt Star Shards. What the hell's that thing? Is that baby Bowser? This is bringing me back to Superstar Saga. Baby Bowser swiped both Cobalt Star Shards. <laughs> Losers! I thought you could get away with stealing my toys over my castle, did ya? It's payback time. I'll take back my toys plus whatever you picked up as compensation. Prince Bowser, let's scram! Oh, you dick. Don't think you'll be getting away with this! Cruel fate, we finally succeed in recovering the second shard, and now this happens. Sham's cycle initiated. We must return to our own time and rework our strategy. And we just go back. To the present! Let's pick up our children and go see the professor. All right, what's next, professor? About time you boy showed up. Ran into some perkish persnickety obstacles, did you? I am in deep shame. I am deep in the shame cycle, Professor. We nearly had a pair of fragments, but that young Bowser fella made off with them both. <laughs> now, now, no need to get your leather lathered. There have been new time holes popping up here faster than the morning and then toast on Sunday morning. Oh my, there's several of them. And I'll tell you, one of them is giving off tremendous Cobalt Star's energy readings. No doubt that the time hole you want. That, that's where Baby Bowser made his escape. Mario, Luigi, we must chase. We must have redemptitude. <laughs> Look now, before you rush off, I think it'd be wise to survive the rest of the castle. And another thing, there's a noisy fella in the past running around with a baby. He and Toadsworth were in the garden. Can you make sure there's no hoopla out there? I guess. If I have to take care of them. Uh, I'll do my shopping now. Why not? It's fun to go shopping. Welcome to the shop. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, no, not yet. First, I want you. Gear is more important right now. Let's see what we got. Ooh, preferred pants. Yes. I'll be buying two pairs of preferred pants. And two pairs of the branded slacks. There we go. What badges you got? Increase experience when you defeat an enemy with attack items. Increase coins when you use attack enemies to defeat enemies. Slightly increase points used to recover using mushrooms in battle. 
And nothing really that I want right now, probably. So I think I'm just going to get out of this for now. Let's go to the item store. And something I forgot to mention, which I will bring up afterwards, after I'm done shopping here. I'll need quite a few of these. Perhaps nine will do. Some mushroom drops. These things are good. One up mushrooms. Let's pick up two. Refreshing herbs. I don't really need any right now. Let's just pick up five more of these. And five more of these. I think that should be sufficient. What brother's items you've got? Ooh, a smash egg and an ice flower. The ice flower is pretty much the same thing as the brother's flower. The smash egg, I'll buy one and I'll show you guys. Let's just buy two. Back in the poster there, there is a Easter egg, I guess you could say. It's Prince Paisley from Mary and Luigi Superstar Saga. Okay, get out of the way. Alright, let's go see what Toadsworth is up to. I guess if we have to. Oh, the racket! Look lively now, Elder May. We must place the princess. Put your back into it. I'm absolutely spent. Pull yourself together, man. Smile, I say, smile. Toads with the younger. The princess, she won't. She won't stop crying. Tut tut, worry not, Elder May. We haven't begun to amuse. Arms out now. Three, two, one. Toes with twist. Jolly good, Elder May. Our charge is giggling. Oh, Master Mario and Luigi, grown up right, haven't you? I'm quite up to speed on our crisis, but a bit of a sticky wicket. The adult princess page in the kingdom, you must save it all. I shall be right here as you do, rooting for victory. What's that you say, old Bane? You wish to learn our move? Well, if it will help you fulfill your duties, of course. It would be an honor and a privilege. Come on, practice awaits. Chin up, Elder May. Mustn't bother now. We've taken a calling to this technique called a spin jump. You'll soon see precisely why Master Luigi begins the move. Are we all quite ready? Good. Commence the instruction. Tutorial time! First press the R button to make Master Luigi's icon jump change, whatever. Next, press the B button so Master Luigi leaps up and perches on Master Mario's shoulder. From there, press the B button again and make the two of you twirl about in the sky height and rise skyward. And now it's rather academic. Press a direction on the control pad to fly in said direction. Huzzah! The marvelous technique will allow you to cross gaps where mere jumping proves lack or proves lacking. Have at it, yeah, we know. We already know this from Mary and Luigi, don't we? All the memories. All the memories indeed. Yes, yes, jolly good show. I trust you use it to your advantage in the field as well. I should think this spin jump should give you access to some awfully hard to reach areas. Now, time to be off, sir. Utilize the new time hole. Rescue our princess. Please, your majesty, please, just one smile. <laughs> Bitch. Anyways, on that note, I think it's a good time to end this recording right here. So, until next time, buh-bye.